Rajesh who are part of from ACRX. Let's dive into the unboxing experiences. So, as you can see, this is our box, easy check. So, the first thing we need to do is we need to unzip the product. Inside the box, we have an easy check device, a data cable, and a power adapter. Now, as I unbox, you can see the easy check device. It's very portable and very easy to use. To get started, let me guide you through the easy check app. The first thing you need to do is search on the Play Store easy check and install the app. Then we shall log in with our username and password. As you can see, I have logged in to, our, to the app and I can see how many total tests are there, how many tests conducted are there and how many remaining tests I do have. And also you can see the patient statistics, the clinical statistics and the social impact created by each devices. In the below, we have a plus icon where I can add patient, I can see the manual, I can see the records, I can see FAQs and I can also call for a support request. The call for the support request can also be accessed through the WhatsApp button and the call button. We will also find statistics for the patient such as how many males and females you have tested, what was their age group, where they smoker, how many smokers you have tested and what are the alcoholic people you have tested. We will also find clinical statistics such as how many people who had anemia that were tested. Also, you can view things on the social impact, such as how many blood was saved from the test, how many money was saved from the non invasive test, such as how many times it was saved from the non invasive test, medical waste, how much less medical waste was generated, and how much less carbon credit was taken. Apart from this, we have a manual button where you can see the manuals and check the videos for on better understanding. We have the record button where you can view your previous records of the patient. We also have an FAQ section where you will get the answers to the commonly asked questions. We also have a support request button. In the support request, suppose you are facing any difficulty regarding the mobile app or regarding a battery, regarding LED or any kind of a issue, you can present an issue from the drop down section. In case you are facing an urgent issue, you can go to the WhatsApp button and create a ticket for the same. In case you need to call the, our support executive, we will also have call button at the bottom corner where you can click and you will be directed to the call menu. Now I will show you how to test using this EZRX, EZJ, non-invasive hemoglobin meter. We will switch on the device. And simultaneously, we need to ensure that our mobile Bluetooth and location are turned on. Without Bluetooth and location turned on, our test will not come. In the mobile app, we need to click on the plus icon at the bottom corner. After clicking on that, we need to click on the add patient. Here we have various patient details, while three are extremely necessary, such as the name their age and their gender. Without filling this form, we won't be able to proceed. After filling in the form, we'll have to agree to the terms of the use. After clicking on that button, we'll submit the patient details. Here we'll have the instruction on how to place our hand. We'll have to place the left hand ring finger in the device. We need to ensure that the finger is clean. We'll cover the lid of the easy check device and we'll remove the cap. We'll gently place our left hand ring finger to it and we will cover it. After covering it, we'll have the option the mobile app has created the device and we'll click on the button. Now our test is being completed. The test is usually done around 45 to a minute. As you can see, I have got my result. In the bottom, we have 
multiple options such as to retake the test, to download the test and to add uh, one more patient. Now I will show you how to download the test. We need to click on the download button or the bottom arrow. Here we can see our report is downloaded and we can check our hemoglobin level and the result for it. We can also forward this to the doctors and anyone who will be needing this for the prescription purposes. Now one of the best features about this device is the test can also be done in the offline mode. There are multiple reasons why this device might not work properly. Such as if there is a mehendi in your hand, the device might not work properly. If your hands are shaking or too firm, the device might also not work properly. The finger should be placed gently and the hand should be aligned with the device. Also we need to ensure that the finger which is being tested, left hand and ring finger, the skin should not be very tight. In case of that, in case the finger is tight, we will move to the fingers which are soft. The result accuracy might not be the same, but we will get the result. Apart from all of the activities, if you are doing it properly and still not getting the result, you can reach out to us via creating support ticket, via call or via WhatsApp. Our support assistant will promptly get in touch with you.